Hi there, this is Andrew. I'm back with another Lenten Reflection, this time from Luke chapter 15, verses 11 to 24. This is a very famous story that Jesus tells about a son who leaves behind his father in his father's house to uh, only to squander all that he had received from him and then to grovel in return, but to be surprisingly embraced by the father. There are two things that stand out to me from this. Uh, the first is about the son. Uh, we are right from the beginning not to have any sympathy for this guy. We are instead meant to be outraged by his behavior. He says to his father right from the beginning, give me the share that will belong to me. It doesn't even belong to him yet. And he's asking his father to give his inheritance. He's basically saying to his dad, I wish you were dead. This is outrageous. It would have been outrageous to the, the readers of the time and listeners of the time too. So that's the first thing. This outrageous, self-interested, terrible son, really. The second thing is about the father, though. We are told that the father has compassion on him. That's why he runs to greet him when he sees him coming off in the distance. That's why he embraces him in his arms and kisses him. That's why he puts his very best robe on him and a ring to treat him basically like a prince. This is the grace of God, the generous, extravagant grace of God, which loves the son who has done basically everything wrong. And that's how God loves us too. Yes, we wander. Yes, we are self-interested. Yes, we take for granted all that God has provided for us. And yet, when we return to him with repentant hearts, he embraces us. He celebrates our homecoming each and every time we return to him.